know, when I first started using video and getting into marketing with video, I, I got really focused on the equipment. I used to think it was all about cameras and lighting and microphone, and I think in part because it was such alien territory. So, you know, when you go somewhere new, you start trying to figure out how to read the road signs, right? You go to Europe and you, know, you don't speak the language and you're just trying to figure out how to navigate. And it's just easier to fixate on the tools rather than the process. So I would spend hours on Amazon.com just sort of shopping for cameras. And you know, it's bewildering because you know, there's cameras that are a hundred bucks and there are ones that are five, six, seven, eight thousand dollars. And if you don't have that background, I mean, you don't know, can I get away with using this inexpensive camera? Or do I really need this professional grade thing with the big microphone sticking off it? And, and you start really focusing on that and then you get into lighting. Do I need professional lighting? What's the difference between a soft box or a, you know, a, an umbrella light? You just don't know. Um, but I think the real thing is that you're actually sort of trying to get comfortable by becoming an expert in the technical stuff. And that doesn't, in the end, help you shoot good video, it turns out. It turns out that rather than all this equipment, it's really about you. It's about your personality. It's about figuring out how you're going to communicate effectively and that the equipment is not as important as you thought. So many people think it's about the equipment, and it's not. It's not about all the lights, the Fresnels, and the... Uh, it's not all about that, or the soft boxes. It's about the person. I'm so glad that my training started in the order that it did. I was on stage first, and then I went into video. Because when you come back and learn about the person, when we let people into our lives, when we can look right into the camera and tell the story about who we are and what we've done and how life has taken us along a path, people are drawn in to who we are and what we're doing. That's what's important. Oh, sure. I see lots of videos where people are having flashy things all over the place and they've got cartoons and they're exploding. And you're ending it and you're going, I don't know any more about that person than I did before I started it. Maybe less. I've been entertained. What have I taken away from it? It's all about the person. And that's what's most important about this terrific medium. When you can't be there in person, the video can be. So you want to show who you are.